Hey guys, I'm back. So, um, I've had a lot of requests to make a surf video or continue a bit. So, here, here it is. Um, so, this time we're going to make the surf. So, how can we start? So, if we can remember, we had a shot manager and it had two shots a top spin shot and a flat shot. Um, for me, I chose two keys. So, of course, you can choose any keys. I chose E and F. And today we will add two more shots, so a kick serve and a flat serve. So we will start uh, by doing that. So we go to our shot manager script. Here we have two shots. Let's add two more. So flat serve and kick serve. That should do it for this one. And in our player script, we will copy the inputs, so when we press on a key that we will choose, I will choose R. If we press on R, we will use a flat surf for this time, instead of a flat uh, normal shot. And um, of course we will give it some values for the up and head force. We will do that actually later. So, uh, we come back here and after we hit our choose our shot, remember that before we had a box collider. Let me zoom up on our player. So we had a box collider that when we um, come close or collide with the ball, we hit it with a, a specific force. So we don't need that this time because we will give our own forces. How can we do this now? So we will need to uh, remove or disable this collider. Let's start with do by doing that. So here, get component box collider dot enabled equals false. Goodbye collider, and let's not forget to re-enable it after we hit, so we can play again, of course. True. Okay, then, uh, very important, the position of the ball. So we serve, we don't serve here, we serve uh, above our head. So let's go and do ball dot transform dot position um, equals our transform position plus new vector 3 plus something that will make it go up so I say 0.5 on the x maybe even less 0.2 and uh, 1 on the y and 0 on the z and actually this should go down when we uh, release the key so the ball only goes up after we uh, hit, not before. Okay, that should do it for the ball, of course. And if we remember here in the collision, we have two lines to add the forces. I will copy these two lines because we will no longer need the collider for the serve, of course. And we will place them right after we reposition our ball. So, other should become ball that get component with the body we give it the force just like we did before um, this should be fine so let's try and of course we can hit and everything stays the same of course oh right let's add uh, the flat the kick serve I will say T for the kick serve T not RT and where is the name right here kick instead of flat great okay let's try i really hope i didn't mess anything up because i always do um unity 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 okay so um force and forces the flat i will give it a force of 0.1 and 14 for the hit force the kick will have 2.5 and 14 oh actually this one 14 24. I have tried with the values before and eh, they are not bad, I hope. Okay, moment of truth and press R, aim, boom. That is a flat serve. Okay, let's go here. Actually, let's make this bigger. Okay. Nope, not that. Okay, stop <laughs> moving the ball. Okay, okay, we need to fix something. Uh, when we, uh, the ball goes away, we need to not reset it 
its position this time so it doesn't get in our way and let's try again so our there you go lose the ball it stays there same here cool and we can play again perfect let's try I'm so bad at my own game. Okay. Cool. Now let's try the kick serve. I've only been hitting flat serve, so kick serve is cool too. Slow and steady. G serve and outside. So I think it's pretty good. Um, you can still play with the values, of course. Uh, I've also made the ball a little smaller and the net a little lower, so <laughs> I don't have the serves uh, always in the net. So now let's make an animation for the serve. Um, okay, let's click on up there, go to the animation. I've already created two animations. All we can have, all we have to do is create new clip, name it serve. I I will actually make two. One uh, hitting. The movement and one preparing movement. So his hand will be already up and then he will release. So these two, the serve normal one will have will be attached to the idle. So make transition, make it that, and the uh, the prepare will be uh, normal. So no more transitions. And double click on both, remove the loop time. Don't let it check. Okay, let's actually animate them. So go back to our scene, click on our player, select this uh, sir, normal one, and let's make his racket about here. Of course, you can play with this. Racket up, advance a bit, and rotate his racket down. Now, let's not forget to press on record before we change the positions. So again, start here, record. It, it goes red and we move the positions and hit record again so turn it off and for the uh, prepare we will copy the first one so control C first keyframe and go to the prepare it should be blank so nothing and do control V paste if we preview it stays like that forever so say um, Let's go back to Unity, um, sorry, Visual Studio, player, our player script. So actually we noticed that these two, when we re release, are the same. So let's make them both the same. Move this else and copy input or T. So we don't waste any lines of code. So move this up a little bit so if we press R otherwise if we press T we uh, you know <laughs> make the same things that we used before and then we release and make everything but now we will say animator if we click of course huh? we just press T or R animator dot play dot play um, serve prepare. I named it serve prepare. That's the animation. Also, copy paste here on the R. If we press R or we press T, we play this animation the serve prepare, which is stuck like this. And then, if we release, we will play the serve animation. Um, let's try. I really hope this works. Okay, so get into position, pressing R, aiming, and boom. Then we can play a point. Uh, try to win. I can never win against this bot, he's too fast. Okay, I just won. Cool, let's press T. Not to serve. And it releases. Okay, we can also later fix that we can uh, serve in the middle of the point. So, see, in the middle of the point. 
Okay, so I hope uh, you liked this video and I will see you in the next one. Or maybe not. <laughs> okay, I really hope I make more videos this time. See ya.